It's only half a, a foot per second difference. Last one. It's like half a foot per second difference. Okay, out with the FX Panthera. Average foot per second, 1000.3 foot per second with an extreme spread of 2.5. Average BC of 0 0.146 go over to the other chronograph average velocity of 999.7 so like maybe half a foot per, di foot per second difference uh, in average velocity which is incredibly consistent um, extreme spread of 3.1 and a BC of 0 0.141 that could just be simply down to alignment of the chronographs or it could even be um, the tracking ability. As you can see, I'm shooting through that gap there all the way into them gorse bushes there or just below them gorse bushes in the centre of the screen. That's 320 yards away. I'm tracking these projectiles, 36 grains and slugs through the FX Panthera out to 300 yards. So that like tiny bit of BC variance or like half a foot per second spread could be related to the you know trees causing some interference not i mean don't get me wrong that is incredibly consistent to have two chronographs line up together side by side and produce the same results it's fantastic if you think about it thousand foot per second and you had 10 foot 10 percent you'll be 100 foot per second if you move the decimal point across and have 1%, you'll have 10 foot per second difference. So we haven't even got like, well, it's not even not even one foot per second difference. Uh, super, super, super consistent. Good, reliable results.